So in this patient, we will correct um, 2.69 diapersis here and minus 0.6 of sill. This is the wave front refraction we see over here. And uh, I did a little bit of a precision adjustment, plus 0.2 diopters because the manifest was slightly lower. And I will give a 10% nomogram add because the patient is very young. I like to use large treatment zones. I have a 7 millimeter optical zone here. And the total ablation is 67 microns. I will start with drying the skin around the eye. Then I will place an adhesive straight. It comes on to the Gesicht. It fits around the eye. I keep everything sterile. Kopf noch bisschen mehr ins Genick. Okay. I reposition the patient's head. Jetzt bitte beide Augen aufmachen. Now I tape the lashes. Nach oben schauen. I start at the upper lip using a 3M Tegaderm drape. I like to do all this under the visage laser because I have a much better view and better accessibility of the eye. I have a fixation light for the patient. This is a very nice combination to use the uh, visage and the new IFS because you just swing the bed from one to the other. Now I introduce a lid speculum. This is an aspirating lid speculum which keeps the eye pristine after the treatment because I can irrigate and aspirate. Strict etwas. Now I wash the eye and I do a first time engagement of the eye tracking as the iris registration just to make sure I get positive iris registration. Then it's very important to dry the conjunctival sac to avoid a lot of fluid accumulating between the acclination cone of the IFS laser and the cornea. So I meticulously dry the conjunctival sac. I got good iris registration here too. Next thing is I will place the suction ring. I like to do this under the visage laser too. Sie schauen schön auf das Blinken der orange-rote Licht. I depress the syringe to four only to have not too much suction. I center around the pupil, press on the eye and slowly release the plunger to avoid a very sudden increase of suction which may cause some damage to the vitreous base. Now I tilt the eye slightly away, the head slightly away from the eye, bring up the patient's bed and then dock. Once I'm centered to the suction ring and I hear the beep, I will open the suction ring and let the PI come down on the cornea, make sure I get a little bit of a meniscus, especially at the valve plug position. Then we will center using the software. Now we have perfect centration. You see this is a 150 degree side cut and we're using a side cut energy of 0.75. It's a 110 micron slab. Now everything is fine and we will start the treatment. You see the wonderful meniscus here, only very, very few OBL forming at the very periphery because the pocket works very well. This is just a perfect set. The ablation just touches the meniscus and we get almost no OBL in the bed at all. This is a 150 degree side cut. Now I release the suction and come up with the laser head. Hat alles super funktioniert, sehr gut haben Sie mitgemacht. It's just a 15 second flap time. Kopf etwas mehr ins Genick. Now we switch over again to the Visex laser. I do custom wave front in 100% of the cases. Basically 99.5 because there is the occasional case where you cannot get the wave front capture. This is beautiful because we have only these very, very light OBLs you would expect. And once I lift the flap, they will immediately disappear. I like a bimanual technique for the lift. I open the edge at the 6 o'clock position. You see how easily this is done, even with the 150 degree side cut, the inverted side cut. I use a special forceps and just gently pull the flap upwards, which works beautifully here again. And then I fold it upon itself using the side of spatula to avoid any um, drying, of, drying of the flap during the ablation procedure. Geht sehr gut bitte auf das blinkende Licht schauen. I tell the patient to look at the blinking light and dim the lights. Schön aufs blinkende Licht schauen. So ist es besser. Super. 
Mitten drauf. Können Sie es erkennen? Super. Look at the blinking light. Sehr gut. Ein blinkendes Licht. Super. Etwas höher. Jawohl. Jetzt müssen Sie es sehen. Okay. Now I will engage Iris registration. We got very nice Iris registration. The rotation is just 0.4 degrees and the off center is 0.29 millimeters. Now the treatment starts. Sie schauen schön als blinkende Licht. Super machen Sie mit. The patient keeps looking at the blinking light. I will use a Maricel sponge just to cover the hinge to protect it from ablation. We have an excellent treatment here. The patient is very cooperative. Everything works very well. As I said, it's a 7 mm optical zone I'm using. And this like is a variable spot laser. Spot size here varying between 0.5 and 6.5 mm. It speeds up the ablation time considerably. Now the ablation is done. I will bring up the lights and start the correction light again. I start the aspiration and then I unfold the flap upwards and then bring it back in one smooth movement. Then I go under the flap and irrigate using a Lindstrom multiport irrigation tendula. Turn off this charm while I tell the patient to actually look at the light. Next I, I use a very smooth, very soft and wet Maricel. I smooth the flap back into place and just carefully dry the edge. And as you can appreciate here, this is a 150 degree side cut. We have a beautiful edge. Basically the flap fits under the anterior lamella of the cornea, which gives us an excellent fit, number one. It also gives us a very nice healing, a very strong healing because there's more contact area between the peripheral stromal lamella and the edge of the flap. I did an animal study showing this healing about twice as strong with the inverted side cut as compared to the standard 70 degree side cut. So my preferred side cut right now is definitely the 150 degree side cut with the new IFS laser. The eyes look much better, have much stronger healing, and probably more better visual results also. This was very easily done here, very nice. Everything worked very well. And I'll wait about 30 seconds and then we will basically move on to the follow eye. I usually do both subcranial surgery, as mostly everybody else does too. Gut, alles gut gegangen. Das passt, ne? Ja, ja, ist alles wunderbar. Finally, the lid section and will be removed. Kommt diese Klammer wieder raus. Alles gut gegangen. Sie dürfen ihr Auge zumachen, ganz langsam. Kann ich wieder aufmachen? Moment. Und wieder aufmachen. Excellent. Gut, that's it.